Hopeless Kingdom is a story about a young Sudanese family's journey of migration from Sudan to Egypt, Egypt to Australia. It's told through the interchanging perspectives of a mother and her daughter Akita, who was about six when her feet touched Australian soil. Throughout the story, you follow them both along on their shared and separate journeys as they take in, react to, and are shaped by the growing world around them. It is heavily inspired by my own journey of migration, by my mother's journey of migration, by my family's journey of migration. And we did really move from Sudan to Egypt and then Egypt to Australia in 2003. So I guess in a major way, that is the catalyst for Hopeless Kingdom. Winning this year's Miles Franklin Literary Award would be something that I, at this moment, I am unable to comprehend. I'm still processing the delight of being shortlisted. It would mean that a story about young Sudanese girls and young Sudanese boys and migrant men and women and parents, a story about family and mental health and struggling to fit in as a migrant would become mainstream in Australia. I feel like I have been very blessed on this journey so far. Hopeless Kingdom is my debut novel and it's my first manuscript to the extent that it has been written in and it feels like my journey in the writing world is only just beginning.